Determine whether the following series converge. If they converge, then find their sum. You have the sum from k equals 1 to infinity. 1 over k squared plus 7k plus 12. We can factor this into 1 over k plus 3 times k plus 4, which if we use partial fraction decomposition, would just be 1 over k plus 3 minus 1 over k plus 4. So this is a telescoping series. So if we're looking, let's say, at the sum of the first n terms, we see that the first term will just be 1 fourth minus 1 fifth plus 1 fifth minus 1 sixth all the way up to um, 1 over n plus 3 minus 1 over n plus 4. And now a bunch of things are going to cancel. We have the 1 fifths, the 1 sixth, and the 1 over n plus 3. So this would just equal 1 over 4 minus 1 over n plus 4. And now if you want to take the sum from k equals 1 to infinity of the original, that's just the same thing as taking the limit of the partial sum. So that would be 1 over 4 minus 1 over n plus 4. And so this will be 1 fourth. So that's going to be the sum of this. The next one we have is the sum from k equals 1 to infinity, 3k to the negative 2 fifths power. I'm going to rewrite this as 3 over k to the 2 fifths. And this is a p-series where p is 2 fifths and it's less than or equal to 1, which means this diverges. The last one we have is a sum from k equals 1 to infinity, negative 2 thirds raised to the k plus 1 power. I'm just going to rewrite this as k equals 1 to infinity of negative 2 thirds times negative 2 thirds to the k power. This is geometric series where k is between negative 1 and 1, so this is going to converge. So the formula is the first term over 1 minus the ratio. The first term, we plug in k equals 1. We have negative 2 thirds times negative 2 thirds, which is 4 ninths. And then the ratio is negative 2 thirds. So we have 4 ninths over 1 minus negative 2 thirds. We'll just add these, is 5 thirds. And then we can simplify this. This 9 will be turned into 1. This 3 will turn into 1. And then we have 4 over 15 as our final answer.